Yeah, how do we know it's uh, true? So I have a lot of trouble with uh, the word truth, the idea truth, and I'm not uh, like a complete relativist, but I'm just uh, personally uh, deeply troubled by uh, being unsure, and I'm doubtful about everything, and I am not uh, confident that anything I do with my life will turn out to be good or true in the, in the long run. We are dabbling in the unknown, and the experiments that we do could be fatal. It could be that we just contact evil sp spirits and get uh, shriveled in, into a dried up thread. So uh, I have, and I think maybe uh, my companions in this, we have all been guilty of a kind of innocence where we assume it's good. We have, you know, skirted badness, bad trips. And I've always managed to escape bad trips with my naive little theory that love conquers all, more or less, that I have a uh, lamp of uh, goodness in my head or in my being somewhere, which is uh, bigger than the darkness, and it will always come out well. So if I didn't have this uh, naive optimism, then I would be scared to death to do any exp of these experiments. And uh, I consider it's a miracle that I'm still alive. We are all here despite these uh, diseases like bird flu and um, rat poison that's put in pet food and so on. We have managed to survive and have long lives while at the same time taking ridiculous risk in exploring over the frontier of the known into the, you know, maybe some people will die and others will survive. And in the long run, I do think, given enough time, which we don't have, that we would actually discover, learn, evolve sufficiently that we could be a species with a future on planet Earth. But unfortunately, the troubles are coming along much faster than our learning curve. Like my uh, long time, what is now 40 years of uh, exploring the unknown here and figuring out um, my little theory about the mind-body problem, consciousness, the vibrations, the classical Sanskrit literature, and so on, which I've now put in the form of... Uh, computer simulation of mathematical models that can show everybody what here's a kind of a physics, as it were, like a quantum physics of the mind-body connection. But my papers on this subject are unpublished. They probably remain unpublished. That They're too outré to uh, actually be absorbed by the world or, or have any effect. So the rate, uh, you see, of the advance of scientific knowledge or accepted reality, that, that rate is extremely slow. Everybody, including us, very conservative about changing the base, which is maybe good. But our evolution is so slow and our devastation is so fast. This has always made me a little pessimistic.